Hi, this is Trisha from blogherway.com. In this video, I'm going to be talking about the Google Drive Power Up for Trello. Trello is an online work productivity tool that you can use to manage your blog and business. Google Drive is a great online tool to create documents and to store your digital data. What is nice is that you can integrate Google Drive into Trello. That way you can easily access documents from Google Drive within Trello itself. Without using a power up, by default within Trello, you can attach a document from Google Drive. To do this, let's go ahead and create a card. So we'll say create blog post. And then in this card, when you go under attachment, you can select Google Drive. You will need to uh, choose the account that you want to use with Trello. You will need to give uh, Trello access to your Google account. Go ahead and click on allow. After allowing Trello access to your Google Drive, you can then select the document in which you want to attach. Go ahead and select that document and press select. Once it is uh, attached, you will see your um, an image here, thumbnail of your document. Trello also offers a Google Drive power-up which extends the functionality of Trello and Google Drive. From here you can click to enable Google Drive. You can also do it by going to get power-ups. From here you can click to enable Google Drive. You can read the description here of what Google Drive Power Up offers, and then you can click to enable the Power Up. To finish setting up the Google Drive Power Up, you'll need to click here to connect your Google Drive to Trello. Choose an account that you want to use with Trello. And then again, you'll need to uh, grant Trello access to your Google account. Go ahead and click on Allow. After you have connected your uh, Google Drive to Trello, you'll now see um, additional information. You can see uh, the created date, the modified date of that document, um, and then when you click on it, you will be taken uh, directly to that document, which is nice. Now that you have the Google Drive Power Up enabled, there are a couple of things you can do directly from Trello using Google Drive. So in the right hand uh, column here under Power Ups, you can go ahead and click on Google Drive. Um, you can either choose to uh, create and attach a file, attach a file, or attach a folder that is already created. In this example, let's go ahead and create and attach. Typically when I start a blog post, what I like to do is I like to create a folder and then within that folder, I can add any of my images, I can add any uh, documents that are related to uh, that blog post. So in this case, let's go ahead and create a folder. Trello will automatically create a folder for you and then you ha now have the option to um, edit in Google Docs by clicking on the button here or you can choose to uh, close that menu and then you can also um, open that folder directly within Google Drive here. Then it will pull up that folder for you. After creating your folder, uh, what I recommend you doing is going ahead and moving it to where you would want your folder to sit within your Google Drive. That way you can keep your um, documents organized um, in Google Drive with this new folder. By default, it will just create this folder under My Drive, so if you have a folder location of blog posts where you um, file all the information related to your blog posts, I would go ahead and do that now after creating your um, Google folder. Since we have already created a document on this card, let's go ahead and open that document and then move it in to our Google folder that we just created for our Trello card. So go to File and Move. 
and then select the folder that you created and select move. When we jump back into our Trello card after refreshing our Trello board, you will see that that document that you added into that folder is now visible within that folder area on our Trello card. In this case, you could choose to remove that attachment since now it is available already um, under our Google Drive folder. Another way to add a power up to your board is by going to the menu. So go ahead and click on show menu and then you can select power ups here. In this case, we've already added Google Drives, but you can select the power up and then you could uh, search for uh, the Google, Google Drive here and then um, you could select add. Um, in this case, we've already done that, but this is another way to add a power up to your Trello board. Thank you for watching this video on how to use the Google Drive Power Up for Trello. Be sure to like this video and leave a comment below. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel where I share helpful tech tutorials on how to run your blog and business. This is Trisha from blogherway.com. See you next time.